Hello everyone, and welcome back to a new episode of Sea of Stars. The last time we left off, we were hanging out over here in funky electronic dance music land. And, uh, I believe we can take this now. The elevator is online. Exit factory. I'm done with this factory. We're out of here. Alright, so... New stuff. We have a town. I guess wheels doesn't exist in this world, huh? Yeah. Um, I have also seen uh, comments from the previous videos now, and uh, people were mentioning like this is a different world. A lot of people mentioned it. Um, I was just keeping the idea of it potentially being the future in my head because I have seen in games before people being like, oh, this is my world, but it is actually just the other world in the future. So I was keeping myself open to that idea, but yeah, I mean, it makes sense given the context that we know about uh, Ephraim and everything that uh, he's going to straight up different worlds and messing them up. So this is just a totally different world, but yes, yes, I know this is another world. I get it, but uh, yeah, just wanted to get that out of the way. But I was keeping myself open to the idea of it possibly being in the future somehow or something. So let's go over here. Hi everyone. They're not doing great. My house is all the way up. We can make our plans there. Hey, let's, uh... Any of you understand wheels? It's from a totally different place. Wow, they have rainbow conscious here. So maybe, yeah, maybe they do have wheels here. Hello. Well, this is where this would be. Wheels does not exist here. It makes sense. I mean, man, I wish there was some way to cheer people up. It's like I'm the only one other than Sarai who still has some energy, but I'm no fighter. From another world, right? You got any games out there? Oh, I'm bringing... Wheels, huh? That sounds like it could be fun. I'm straight up bringing wheels to this world. Do me a favor and ask that watchmaker from your world if there's any way to get a table delivered here. Love to play some wheels. That... Yo, no, I, w I will look into that for you. I think I can do that now. Feed me something sweet. Uh, I mean, a peach strudel is sweet. Tasty. Feed me something warming. That would be... soup. Tasty. Feed me something meaty. Uh... I mean, the fish pie, I guess, or the sashimi. I'm gonna give you a fish pie. Not meaty enough. Feed me something meaty. Okay, so... We're gonna need to, uh... Go rest. Need to rest? Yeah. Thank you. Appreciate it. So, um... Meaty. So we can, we can make, like, some beef stuff. So, uh... That's 155 HP, that's a lot. Um, so the stew could work? Or like a roast sandwich. Yeah, Let, let's just make you a roast sandwich since that's like one of the cheapest options here. There you go. Are you gonna ask for something fishy too? Because if you do, then... I mean, I guess I have, uh... The, um... Sashimi for that. And, uh, and the Bouillabaisse, base, I suppose. Something meaty. Um, roast sandwich. Tasty. Feed me something light. Uh. That might be the sashimi or this. And, uh, you probably want, like, a salad, don't you? We, we had, like... I, I do believe we have a recipe for, like, a salad. God, how many things are you gonna want me to give you? Cook. So, didn't we have a salad? Basic salad. Yeah, that's totally what you want. Okay. Hopefully... Hopefully, I don't need anything else. <laughs> Salad's gotta be the light thing. 
light. Basic salad. There. Tasty. Feed me something from the water. Uh, this should count for that. Tasty. This was everything I ever wanted and more. Dispensing reward. Ooh, rainbow conch. Okay, cool. There we are. Nice. So, let's go ahead and hit the save up there. Boom. And let's head out. Cool. So, hi. No peace left in our hearts. That was a very well-hidden uh, rainbow conch. Glad I managed to find that one fairly easily. I could see that one being one that I would miss. Uh... Ooh. Ooh, thank you. Okay, there's some food up there for me to grab. So, I'm just trying to make sure I knock everything out that's on the bottom floors here. Hi. This place is interesting. I'm trying to make sure I don't see anything lurking in any of the corners here. Can't interact with that. No, no. Okay. Looks like we're good. Someone must have known. Ooh. Treasure. Data strip. With enough strips, a cipher could be created. Interesting. Are these poten is, are these potentially a collectible unique to this world? Neat if so. Sarai, why would you return? Ooh, food. Yeah, so there's just like sparklies on the ground that I can pick up. Neat. They did too much to us. Hi, what's in here? Give me that, thank you. So is there gonna be another place for me to redeem Rainbow Conscious? Cause I think I almost got all the rewards from the ones back in the other world, so. Sealed using powerful encryption, a cipher might do the trick, aha. Ooh. Adamantite staff, kyber steel blade. Pliant shell vest and a nano injector, an implant for Sarai that removes one star from allies entering KO state. Uh, that's cool. Kinda. Not that crazy about it though. Valuable meant to be sold. It's worth eight gold. Are you sure? Oh, I mean, we gotta sell all of Garl's stuff. Yeah. There we go. So, we're working with some money now. Um, I generally don't think there's a reason in having a lot of this old armor either. So maybe we can sell some of this stuff too, because I need money. This is actually better for Sarai. I don't know why I don't have it on her. Yeah. Okay, but at least I can get the two weapons for you two. The defenses, I'm not as crazy about, and the nano injector, I'm gonna be honest, I'm not as crazy about either. Like, it's fine, but ideally I don't want people to get knocked out in the first place, so... Yeah. Um, I think I will buy this for Sarai at least, because she can definitely use the upgrade. Uh, it's not as big a deal for Rashan, so... All right, thank you, merchants. And we need to come back there with a cipher. Get it out of my head. Uh-huh. I still see it in my dreams. I'm on a way back to my mind. I wish that I could give up. Oof. We're not having a good uh, time here. Ooh, 100% MP. Pudding Komir? Is that how you pronounce that? Komir, Chomir. I think it's Komir. Not super familiar with that particular accent over a letter. Or that particular marking over a letter. And what it means. Hi. What do you have? Just a different merchant. Oh, you sell this stuff. Pandore. 
Interesting. Ooh, yakitori! Shrimp! Okay, give me that. That seems cool. More, uh, more f uh, food recipes is always neat. And also, it'll use my seafood, which I have way too much of. So using up some of that is a fantastic, fantastic thing. Uh, so I did manage to climb up here. Mm. I used to feel... How can I go on? I don't want to stay. Uh, sorry, I didn't mean to talk to you. We should have turned the other way. Okay, I'm guessing uh, Sarai's gonna give us a little bit more of an explanation of what exactly is going on here. Um, also, uh, I mentioned last time that uh, I got <laughs> I misspoke and said the sun or the moon was covered by clouds, but but no, it's obviously the sun that makes way more sense. Although I guess you could block the moon's power with clouds, but blocking the sun's power with clouds makes way more sense. Good morning, Cedric. Good morning, Sarai. I see your journey to other worlds in search of Solstice Warriors has proven successful. Odds increase. Drastic. What's the status? Moon still sunken. Sun remains blocked by clouds. Fleshmancer yet inhabits the castle which cannot be reached. Active threat. Dweller of Dread. Any recent events? Fleshmancer activity detected a few days ago. Fleshmancer left briefly for another world, returned with new monster lieutenant named Elisan Darrell. Elisan Darrell. Fleshmancer left briefly for another world, which would be our world, returned with new monster lieutenant named... So that's what, um... Uh, God, why, I, why can I not think of her name right now? What's her face got turned into, I'm guessing. Yeah, Erlina. Confrontation with Els Elisandarel not recommended. We'll see about that. Recommended action, use Solstice Warriors to defeat Dweller of Dread. Recommended action, dependency, make for sky base to remove clouds and reconnect sun and moon. But how to get there? Surveil of the Cerulean Expanse continued while you were away. And? Faint energy was detected, concordant with old records about the dead of a forgotten race. The dead of a forgotten race, and Rashan has a reaction to that. Rumored builders of the Speedball Network might know a way to bring it back online. Analysis of rails and ramps confirms Speedball Network as a potential route into Skybase. Recommended action, follow survey probe through Cerulean Expanse and investigate signal. Shot analysis, long. At least we have a lead. Presence confirmed of servants of the Queen that was. Confrontation likely unavoidable. Don't worry, they can fight. Probe calibrated, will beat faster to show objects of interest. Good luck. Got probe. It's really an expanse. Could they really be somewhere in there? Still alive somehow? One more thing, Cedric. Yes. I want them to see what we are facing. Dweller of Dread? Show them. Dispatching drone. Ooh! Oh, that's neat. Uh, this is setting off my thalassophobia a little wee bit. Uh, I don't like it. Oh, I really don't like it. Okay, hi Cthulhu. Yeah, I don't like that. Your people. We're taking this thing down. Solstice Warriors demonstrate emotional investment, might negatively affect performance. Recommended action, breathe in. Don't worry about us, the monster's getting its due. 
Recommended action. Breathe out. <laughs> Thanks, Cedric. Okay, first the moon is the shine again. We need you to at full power. Cerulean Expanse is east of Rapine. Here's hoping whatever we find there will be able to help. Teeks? You go ahead. I want to talk with Cedric. I'll catch up later. Okay, have fun. It's probably very exciting for you. Encryption console online. Pre-present any data strips you may have. Encryption not possible unless more data strips are found. Recommended action. Find more data strips. Yeah, and that'll get us into that building in town. Okay, so we have a few things to do. We need to go and bring... What's it called to this world? I wonder if I can... Just easily leave here. Like, if I just hop back in the Sea of Stars, it'll let me teleport back to, uh... Back to our world. Because it would be convenient to go ahead and get wheels brought over here. Um... So... I don't know, though. I also would have to go back through the factory, I suppose. Eh, it's not really that big a deal, I suppose. Yeah, let, let's, let's... Let's give it a shot. Just because I would like to see. Because, yeah, it's just the elevator and then we leave. The factory. But I would like to see if we can go ahead and do that. Um... So... Let's figure it out, why don't we? Hopefully it's, uh, not too difficult. Boom. Might be a shortcut we can open at some point, so... Yeah, if I just sail right over here into the Sea of Stars, will it let me go back? Yes! I was thinking it probably would. Okay. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So now we go see Clockmaker. Hi! I'm back! You wanna play me in wheels? Self deploying wheels table is ready. Just need a buyer now. Hey, it's me! I'm the buyer. Ping, you say, on another planet. Interesting. The self deploying table's yours for 250 gold. Oh, you don't have enough gold and I can't sell stuff to you. Damn it. That's, that's rough. You want to challenge me to give me wheels? Don't be silly. You haven't beat all the champions yet. Oh, that's rough. Damn. God damn it. If only there was like, if only they offered to buy stuff from you. I could maybe sell enough food and shit. Hey kid, I thought I would come over here and check in, see your rewards list, do I have enough? Uh, I have enough for something potent, not something meta though. 52? Uh, oh hey, it's that, it's that recipe that I saw there, okay, so. Just, just a recipe, nothing too crazy, but I thought I would come check. Hey, I got your money! We have a deal, here. Deployment wheels, deployable wheels table, yay! Alright, was that entirely too much work just to get a game of wheels in? Yes, do I regret it? abso fucking not. Here you go, oh wait, one sec. Could you do me a favor and ask that- oh, never mind. So that's stuff we got. there it is! Beautiful. Alrighty. See, well these rules are simple enough. I'll just take a few moments to analyze all the patterns. Okay, I'm a champion now. Wanna try me? Yeah! Maybe you're my final one, or there's more here. Uh, champion. Let's go, nerd. Alright. Well, I'm, uh, straight up playing against, uh, a cyborg now, so this is gonna be interesting. Um... Using an archer and a... Mm, archer and a warrior makes me feel... Like, uh, I mean, I'll heal off of that. The wall would be best, though, I feel. So, I think we're gonna go you and mage. Builder and mage, because I'm gonna need those walls. Gonna need those walls, I am. That's immediately a really good start. So, yeah, we wanna, we wanna get those walls up. Bang. You're immediately... Already knocking them down. Uh, yes, 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 yes. I'll take it. 
Okay, we are not getting shot. Not yet, luckily. Okay, if we can just get a little bit more... I'll take that. I guess I'll keep you two. There we go. No, I didn't mean... No, okay. Good, we, we still got it. We're good, we're good, we're fine, we're fine. Boom. Bang. Gotcha. Uh, XP for you. Our wall is already high enough, so we don't really need to worry about that. Um... Okay, apparently we're going all in on that builder. That's fine, that does nothing to my wall. Builder's got me, got me covered, I think. Uh... What do you got for me? Uh... I mean, I can... Get rid of that, yeah. Can try to at least get something a little bit better there. Is that enough to... Yeah, get you an attack, good. Bang. Bang. Only two damage, but you are upgraded now. And they've got to focus on getting that wall and keeping it up. Uh, just reroll these. Uh, no, the builder's about to attack. I don't need that. There we go. That's a little something something. Okay. Archer just upgraded as well. I get to do an attack. And keep your wall down. Good, good, good. Uh, what do we got? I wanna, no. I think I wanna focus on the mage now. That's good. That, that was a very, very good roll. Thank you for that. Bang. Bang. Alright, I think I've got you. Oof. That, that hurts. I will say that hurts. You totally annihilated my wall. Um, anything useful? Yeah, I'll take that. Oof, they're gold now though, we gotta watch it. You might directly attack me. I just need to get to one more attack with my mage. Um. But we also gotta make sure we don't die in the process here. Um, you, you. I mean, I can see if I can get some XP or something. No. All right, so that should be enough for my mage to attack. Yeah, then that should be victory. Okay. There we go, wasn't so bad. Um. A builder was definitely, definitely a good call there. <sighs> Luckily you didn't get... You barely were off from that warrior going, Congratulations, you won! Here's something for you. Platinum wheel. Okay, so that... We may actually be able to fight the clockmaker now. Now that I've done that, so... Cool. Um... Should I end things off there? Nah. We can, we can go explore a little bit more, at least go to the next area, even though I probably shouldn't, because I still have to record Messenger after this. But, uh, I've never been one for good decisions. Or we might just fish for the rest of the episode, because this is sitting right here. What kind of fish are we going to be catching here? What's down here? Come on, there's gotta be something. There is! There's a treasure! A data strip! Yay! We need more of those! Okay, it looks like we got, like, flounder and stuff in here. There should be all new types of fish, right? Yes, four new types. Alright. Whee! Uh... Come on. Did I... I haven't gotten all the fishing rewards yet, right? Yeah, there's still- I think there's something flimsy I still need to get. A laser burbot. Cool. Ooh, this one looks kind of wild. Is this just the same thing I just caught? Yeah, it is. Look like the same kind of fish. Come here, you. That big thing, whatever it is. It's like flounder looking thing. 
silica uh, or, or silicium sponge. I was gonna say silicon, but no, that would not be right. No, not you. Fine, get over here. Come yeah, on. Beautiful. E you, you're what I want. Okay, and then we need just one more thing here I haven't caught. Uh, Cyber Nard Hermit. Or Hermite. Guessing that L at the end there is like silence or something. Hmm. I think this thing. Yeah, there's like a little thing right there that looks slightly different. It looks like a turtle. Oh, uh, maybe not a turtle. No, that's not a turtle. Or it's that. The coil flounder. Master Angler! Is that all the fish? Catch every fish species at least once. Yay! So that is everything. Cool, cool, cool. So that probably means that's my last wheels person to fight too. Because it's not like I have another one of the wheels tables I can go deploy at a different place if there was another town here. Which I don't think there is another town here, so... Yeah! Yeah, 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 yeah. And there's the Cerulean Expanse. Liking this music. Uh. Uh oh. So the drone's supposed to help us get through here, right? Yeah, that was the whole reason we got that thing. So I kind of expected there to be a save point in there, and there was not. So I'm gonna set up camp. And we're gonna save, so. Hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you- Wait, are, what are you doing here? You liar. I can't believe you lied to me, Teeks. Alright, well, I hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for some more.